boy, am I glad to talk to you today about assembly code and what it means in Minecraft terms. <laughs> so what it means is that... What I mean is that um, assembly code doesn't use the graphics card. It uses the memory card. So it's like playing Minecraft with shaders compared to uh, without shaders. So using a modern PC is like having a, a graphics card with uh, higher level languages. And it makes it, if you use shaders uh, with a high end PC, it will look good, maybe. But, uh, well, it runs kind of slowly, and it's very hard on your PC, and it uses a lot of code. But with a, uh, uh, with a, a, <laughs> a really shitty PC, uh, you can also play Minecraft on it. But the thing is, is that... Uh, you can turn your render distance up to be really far. So, uh, rendering, uh, going up <laughs> far, uh, uses up your memory, not your, not your graphics. So, it will look really shitty, but you can see really far. And the thing is, when your graphics look really... <laughs> really shitty uh, then you can see really far and also it's not hard on your PC at all except unless well not your graphics card that is might be on your memory depending on how far you see <laughs> it's it's pretty neat so <laughs> So, in other words, uh, uh, higher level languages are like using a, a graphics card in Minecraft with shaders, but your game runs really shitty. <laughs> but with, uh, with, with assembly code, it's like not having shaders and seeing really far, maybe. It <laughs> And you have a high FPS, a very high FPS. Uh, I meant if you use the same computer, I think. And, uh, and, but you can turn the render distance up. And, uh, the render distance uses the memory, which is different. So that's my simple, very clear, concise uh, Minecraft assembly. Explanation. So thank you for wasting my time. <laughs> thank you for wasting my uh, my time. I'm cooking an egg downstairs. It's great. Bye. So one extremely very important thing that was was not mentioned it was it's very important so i'm going to go to that point immediately without wasting any time whatsoever so that i can tell you exactly what comes next the thing that comes next that i am going to mention is that, uh, uh,
All right. Assembly code's different than other programming languages because instead of having a compiler, which doesn't matter because we'll never talk about it again, so you don't need to know what that means. Instead of a compiler, you're the assembly code. Uh, puts and moves around data manually, meaning if you want to move something to different places in the computer to do different functions and do different things, you have to do it manually. Meaning that if you want to store a number in your computer, you have to manually put in where it is going to go, which slot in your storage hardware controller thing it is going to go. So uh, I can't really think right now for some reason. Uh, uh, so it's the uh, the uh, the assembly code is very closely intertwined with the hardware. Which means that the fu many of the functions in assembly code are specifically dealing with the hardware. And that's what makes it uh, a cool snazzy language is that you have to learn about the hardware, about your computer, which can be really fun. I could use, even use Minecraft to show it. It's like people making a computer in Minecraft that can, you can play a game on a computer in Minecraft. It's made the same way assembly code is. And so you'd be able to visually see that in Minecraft. Wow, that's great. It's like almost time for bed. I'm going to watch a movie. I eat an egg. Uh, was it Minecraft? Hobbs from Mince Root. Uh, what was it? Well, even though it deals with the hardware on the computer, the assembly code, uh, it was made a long time ago. So, uh, your new PC is probably going to, like, be a little overpowered for it so uh it should be able to you know do everything i think it's interesting isn't it's useful it's a fact I think maybe they should have made Minecraft before assembly code, but that's what I think. If you can make a computer in Minecraft, why couldn't you make assembly code out of Minecraft first? So, the thing is, you have to talk to you directly. I think we're going to be very disappointed to know this. Is that, um, well, you're going to have to do a lot of work 
what does it look called? Which means that uh, every single little tiny thing in assembly code has to manually be done. Meaning that you don't have shortcuts, you don't have that, this or that, it's completely raw. So, uh, you're going to have to do everything by yourself. And, uh, you're going to have to move every byte to the, where, whatever storage place it needs to go. You need to make every single line of code that moves almost every single pixel. You need to do all of that. There's a fun fact that the uh, old SNES games, S-N-E-S -E games, were made in assembly code. Yes, they were. So if you can, like, uh, if they did it, maybe, maybe you could do it. I don't think you can, but maybe you can. Mm, interesting. So, the thing is with assembly code is it's memory yes so the the thing with that is that uh doesn't use the graphic card doesn't and because of that you won't need one or assembly code which means if you make a game with the graphics, but with assembly code, you would still not need a graphics card, which does not happen with other games. Isn't that cool? Isn't it? I think it is. Not really, though. I lied. So the, the last thing before I go, because this is a waste of my time, is that, uh, not your time to watch this, but my time. I'm much more valuable, that's why. Was, uh, I don't know why. And since I'm the one watching this, I'm not sure how that works. But I'll figure that out. So the thing, uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh. Makes you feel smart, doesn't it? Very, very wise, I think. Especially with the Minecraft concepts related to it. How Minecraft is like the epitome of assembly code, even though it has nothing to do with it. So, it's probably why it does, is because it's so unrelated to it that they just are similar. So the other thing with my PC is that, uh, hmm. well, it does work. You do need a PC that works for assembly code. You can't do assembly code on your TV. Uh, you need, you don't need a mouse to get your PC working. But if you want to log in or uh, open a file, then you need a mouse. 
you do need a keyboard, but not to turn into that. <laughs> The, uh, the computer on. You do need a, a monitor so that you can uh, program. Because if you have everything else but you don't have a monitor, well, you can't do that. So, I was going to say something important. I said I'd get to it quickly, and I think 12 minutes is fairly fast. So, it was, uh, I didn't see it yet. I don't remember what it was. But since I remember everything, it must not be important, which means I was very efficient. I just had so much time I could talk about other things. I just didn't need to say it. I didn't tell you that because I guess I didn't think it mattered that you knew that. It's probably watching my Minecraft footage right now. It's pretty fantastic. Minecraft is a great game, but it's going to die soon. So, uh, enjoy what it lasts. Obviously, obviously, you can still play it while the game's dead. But you won't. Your friends won't really like you anymore because they don't like you either. <laughs> and since they don't like you. They're just looking for any excuse to drop you like a hat that they're going to drop. And if they think Minecraft's cringy and are playing Minecraft and it's dead, then you're not going to have any friends anymore. I know because I did that to my friends. It's the survival of the fittest. And the reason it's not fit, but fit is, is because none of us are really that fit, but yeah, I'm almost ready, but some people are, are obviously much more fit than other ones, so if we don't uh, go outside our little circle, then I think we'll actually feel pretty good about ourselves. So, I think that's it. I'm not sure any of this was actually useful. I ge genuinely do not believe any of it was useful. Uh, I think the useful things I was going to say were things I realized. I, I, I don't care about it because I'm going to watch a movie. And I can play Minecraft for 15 minutes and upload it on my channel. So, yeah, I also uh, am a little scared of Hero Brian. After seeing my videos today, it made me realize that, uh, Maybe he's too... He's too powerful. Is that... So also that, uh... With Minecraft and Assembly Code, is that, uh... You know, they're kind of the same, so... I think there's a lot to learn. So... Uh... Yeah... I'm... <laughs> I'm looking forward to uh, making, or I mean like, not making, it sounds weird, of a, uh, like cooking some more eggs tomorrow. So, bye.
I still have my elixir. I'll be back. But enough about me. Let's kill you!